Now she knows all the great fashion trending in town. When it comes to time, that's not how she very wise and intelligent. She knows what she wants, so subscribe. Hello, 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 and welcome back to my channel. You are welcome, you guys. You're welcome to my channel. Uh, today I quickly want to, you know, speak about this in Kitchi Blessing again. You know, I know this guy is still gonna come out. I see if I know because the purpose of coming, uh, you know, purpose of him dating in Kitchi Blessing to start with is because of his political career. And as soon as they had the fight, if you guys watch my video or you haven't seen that video, you can scroll back through my videos, then you will see the video whereby this guy is talking about, you know, their breakup, yeah, she doesn't have notoriety, she doesn't have poise and all of that. I knew like maybe he's not getting what he was thinking he could get. But now I think he retraced the step and realized that even if he's not able to dupe Inkechi Blessing or collect money from Inkechi Blessing, he could still use Inkechi Blessing since that was what he told this alleged girlfriend, the person that reached out to me when I first made the video about him dating Inkechi Blessing. The lady told me that when she, uh, she saw the video she he had made with Inkechi Blessing, she called him and uh this guy was saying oh you know it's you that i love blah 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 he was just in Kechi blessing was just there to help him so that he can gain popularity because of his political career anyway if this is your first time you are welcome to my channel if you have been watching but you're still contemplating whether you should subscribe or not what are you waiting for please click the subscribe button down below and turn on the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever I upload a video. And to all my subscribers that keep coming back, keep returning, I really appreciate you guys. You guys are the real MVP and you are the one that keeps me going, to be honest, because I'm not really impressed with where the channel is. Uh, I've been stuck close to 10,000 for a while now. So, but at the end of the day, you know, life goes on, life moves on. After all, it's not because of the number or because of the money that I'm doing this video. I just started this so that we can learn from each other. And hopefully very soon I'll go back to my live streaming because sometimes when I'm on live video like that and I'm reading comments, but when I come back, we're going to be making calls and stuff. I learned, I learned stuff as well. That is what you guys need to realize. Through your comments, sometimes I'm knowing a lot of stuff that I don't know. So to me, it's more or less like we are learning from each other. I have so much to say and you have a lot to tell me as well. Anyway, you guys, I think I've rambled on enough. So please do subscribe and turn your, not turn your notification bell on. A lot of people tell me they don't get the, uh, the thing. Sometimes YouTube do that. Anyway story of these guys i don't want to go back to it i don't need to give you the you know background story if you haven't seen the story it started from last year so you can scroll back to my videos from last year i made the video you can really you know grab the story entirely and i made another one recently when this guy broke up with inkechi blessing so now this guy went to daddy freeze i don't know who initiated the interview whether it's him that called daddy freeze because as soon as inkechi blessing stopped speaking a about this thing that's why i said in that video in kitchen blessing should just not react to everything it's because this is the reason why this guy initially get with in kitchen blessing is because he want to use in kitchen blessing and i said it anyway let's listen to what he said with daddy freeze then i will show you in kitchen blessings response to this interview i'm pleased to my ex in kitchen no vex no vex me I tell them now. No vex. No vex. I know I feel having a guy show to the world my the love of my life, my husband, and all of a sudden the guy messed up. No vex. If I ever feel me down now, I feel me down, but no vex. Yes. No job, no vex. Eh? You agree that you messed up? And some parts. As well. Okay. Like I need I wanted to forge ahead. Remember I didn't do it in the best possible manner. Oh, I'm very, very, I'm very, very sorry. No. Sorry, you guys. I made a video about you, Le Duce, the, the other time, and I'm talking about, you know, how men never, ever want to take responsibility. Let me not paint all of them with the same brush, but maybe 
like 90% of men, they will never agree to their wrongdoings and they will never uh, say that they are wrong. Like self accountability is lacking in like men and a lot of them, to be honest, they lack self accountability and they don't always accept that they are at fault. You know, the way women will just be like, oh, yeah, only more shoke, I accept all my responses. Even though a lot of women does that as well, no self accountability, they just want to blame everyone and everybody except themselves. So now that the freeze is asking him, do you think that, oh, you messed up, you do this in some part? Do you have to put in some part? Yes, I messed up. Just do the apology and move on. Okay. What we do at times does not define who we are. What defines is how we rise after falling. And from my heart, in KG, from my heart, I still love you. That's so nice. That's so nice. Somebody say kneel down and beg her jaw. Uh, on top, like, see, they are not beg, see, for a kitty. This is my way to give people when they beg them without. Pride. No beg. Right. I love you. Mwah. No beg. <laughs> Oh, sorry you guys that i'm picking his video apart someone said neil that even though i'm not interested because this guy is not genuine from the onset did you hear what he said no like from a in a kitty like they don't kneel down for women is that not what he's saying anyway you guys uh let's let's watch the rest of the video then all, all right let bygones be bygones that's his message awesome guy lovely hanging out with you yeah, uh, okay, so. Look at so, everybody say, oh, even the people that were abusing. Now, love, now, now, when they are talking, now, love, they won't hear. <laughs> if I talk okay. to tomorrow, and say, I won't come back. They will be very happy. It is somewhere blushing. Uh, they, they don't accept. Ah, accepted. Okay, people don't accept. accept you know. yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yes. All right, then. That's a feature. So, it's literally saying that they've okay, accepted his apology. Take are they the one in the relationship or in Kechi blessing? That's what I don't understand. If they are accepting your apology and you are, you know, literally happy about that, who is in the relationship? Them or you and in Kechi blessing? As in Kechi blessing accepted the apology, and this is what in Kechi blessing said, and you can tell that in Kechi blessing is not having it. She's done. Okay, so in Kechi blessing said that it be like say madness they run for some of our family. <laughs> Madness, they run for some of our family. Now, so so rubbish, you know, they post now. Now, see, person, where don't they become irrelevant? Trying to stay relevant again. Now, they help and promote trash. I wish he's using the cloud for something meaningful other than having useless girls slide into his DM. Make nobody tag me to trash, I beg. So now, in Inkechi Blessing is literally saying that what I believe is going on is what Inkechi Blessing is saying. And this is the one that really off to me. I started laughing. And if you see my title, you can see that Inkechi Blessing said, my ex that you can be friend with, you know, saying that to the new ex. Inkechi Blessing, seriously, she jumped so quickly. Number one, Inkechi okay, Blessing doesn't well, have two. Inkechi Blessing jumped into relationship as she's coming out of one. She's going into one. A lot of women does that. And I think what they do is that they believe that jumping from one relationship to another, it shows that a lot of people want them. A lot of people want to date them. And that is not the case. It's, it's not the case. A lot of people want to date you. Even married women, even me itself, where I don't marry, bump picking, three finish. Some people will still come in my DM and I'll be like, are you mad or something? <laughs> are you mad or something? But it's not that I will now see it and be like, yeah, I'm still there. I'm still popping. I know that myself. You know, a lot of them talk about self-love, but they don't love themselves. Truly, truly, if you do, you will take time out. You will work on yourself. You will be a better person. Joining yourself to a man. You don't know what this man is coming with. You don't know the intention of the man. You just jumped into his. And at the end of the day, you are thinking that when I get to that relationship, I will work on myself, then I will be better. No, you are bringing bitterness into the relationship already. You are bringing all the craziness the madness the bitterness from the last relationship that you just finished a week ago you are bringing it into that so sometimes women need to give themselves time to heal from whatever it is that happened whether they are the one that had fought whether it was the previous relationship the man that is at fault they need to really you know look at it at every angle 
where have I wronged? What can I do to make it better in the next relationship? Sorry, guys, I'm giving you relationship advice. I'm really good at that, to be honest. I have young, young girls that always call, come to me for advice. And I'm telling you, work on yourself. Be a better person. Don't go into relationship thinking you will change there or you will do this there. Because when you go there, you are looking out for everything the previous guy did to you. And same thing with guys as well. Especially guys, they don't want their heart to break. But this guy, he deserved everything in Kechi Blessing does to him because this guy doesn't even go into that relationship with good intention. He's a scammer. He's somebody that always dates girls for their money. He goes into the relationship, give them maybe like 100 pounds. Before you know it, he's asking for thousands of pounds. That's what the alleged ex-girlfriend told me about the whole thing. And I believed because... The way this guy move, you can tell, is because of the political career. Anyway, you guys, I'm not going to continue to say so much about this. If you want relationship advice here, you can reach out to me. I am really good at that. Aside from being married, I'm just cool-headed. I don't date that much because I always take my time. Before I got married at all, I, I, I didn't really, you know, go from this relationship. I have a lot of people that will still come with to me for their relationship advice because, you know, when you are cool calm and you look at things you look before you leap that's the way i'll put it anyway you guys i want to hear what you think about this guy trying to apologize are we going to see them next month together kissing and cozying up to each other because if we think it's a blessing you can never tell with that girl anyway you guys let's continue the discussion in the comment section below guys and on your way out don't forget to give this video a thumbs up share if you like it if you haven't please please Hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell and I will see you in the next one. Bye. Subscribe and get that gist with the one and only Debbie Fashta.